everyone and welcome back to my channel. For those of you who are new here, then a warm welcome to you. Thank you for taking the time to tune in. And for all my um, existing subscribers, thank you very much. I truly appreciate you all. My name's Ivy and on this channel I talk about health, well-being and a bit of everything in between. So if you like a bit of variety, come on board. You'll be more than welcome. So I do hope you're doing okay. You know, how are you doing? It's, um, it can be a very stressful time. So, you know, just sit back, chill out with Ivy, get a cup of tea, glass of water, whatever takes your fancy. And um, let's get into this video. So today's video, it's a Wednesday. Is it Wednesday? Yes, it's Wednesday today. And I'm just going to be giving another general update, health, tapering down off prednisolone, because I have news, my friends, I have news. Um, yeah, so stay tuned, be right back. So if you can see a blue glint, you know, in, through my glasses, then I apologise, but there's not a lot I can do about it. Okay, back to the video. So for those of you who don't know, I'm on prednisolone, which is a corticosteroid because I have a condition called myasthenia gravis. It's a severe weakening of the muscles. I also have um, hypothyroidism with Graves' disease, so two autoimmune diseases there. I take the prednisolone for the myasthenia gravis. Um, and... My highest dose of that was 120 milligrams. I have done previous updates. So, you know, if you want to subscribe, please do press the little icon bell down below so you'll know when I upload further videos. So this is the culprit, prednisolone. Um, they come in lots of different doses. The one I take is five milligrams. And uh, I've been put on prednisolone because originally I had myasthenia gravis, but it just affected my eyes, which is like droopy eyes and everything and weakness in the eyes. So that's what I had until last year. It generalized, which meant, you know, face weakness, jaw, eating, chewing, talking, breathing, walking, Weakness in arms, wrists, hands, legs, feet, you name it. I literally couldn't do much. So they put me on prednisolone. Um, and like I said, my highest dose was 120. And then in February this year, 21, 2021, doctors told me that I could taper down by one of these tablets the first of every month. And they're tiny tablets, white little tablets. I'm not going to get one out because probably just drop them. And the doctor said, yeah, I can taper down by one of these tablets every month. Um, so got to August the 1st and I did, as I was told, taper down by one tablet, which got me to uh, 85 milligrams. So from 120 to 85 milligrams, which, yes. You know, I, <laughs> I'm happy about. And then I had a, a telephone consultation with the doctor yesterday, which was a Tuesday, 17th of August. And, you know, he was asking me how I'm doing, tapering down and everything. And I told him, you know, I'm, my body's holding its own, praise the Lord. And then he said, OK, he wants to, sorry, I'm just sweating. Ooh. Hot, your girl is hot. Um, so sorry, got waylaid. Yeah, so he said, asked me how I'm doing, and I said, you know, I'm holding my own. And then he said, okay. He said, what you can do is go down to sixteen tabs. So eighty-five milligrams is seventeen of these little white tablets. And then he said, as of yesterday, because yesterday, I take me prednisolone every other day. So yesterday, the Tuesday, was the day that I, I took me prednisolone. Yeah. 
Sorry if that bit was confusing. I take these every other day. So yesterday, when I was on the phone with the doctor, the Tuesday, that's the day that I was taking me prednisolone. And he said, okay, take 16 instead of 17 tablets. So I was like, okay, all right then. Um, I said, you do know that I just tapered down from August the 1st? And he was like, yeah, um, you start 16 tablets from yesterday. So that's what I did. And then he said, and also two weeks from yesterday, from the 17th, taper down another, yes, another tablet. So I'll be down to 15. Um, so by that time, it, I think it'll be the 31st of August. So that's three tablets, not one, not two, three, almost four, three tablets that he wants me to taper down from. So, wow. Um, I don't know how that will affect my myasthenia gravis, you know, but we shall see because take it one day at a time. Yeah, take one blessed day at a time. That's all I can do. Um, I am excited, scared at the same time, you know, because it was hard when that weakness truly set in being you know being able to do absolutely nothing couldn't even scratch my ass let alone wipe it okay tmi sorry but yeah um you know like i said to the doctor i'm holding my own sleep can be a big thing i think when i was on a higher like up near the hundred hundred and twenty I slept okay. Is that weird? Let me know if you're on prednisolone, how your sleep patterns are. But I, I did, I slept. As I'm coming down now, I'm finding that I can sit in a chair and fall asleep like that. Because trust me, you're lucky that you're not sitting here just watching me like... Because <laughs> I've tried hard not to fall asleep. Because it's just the fatigue, I'm just tired. Blink my eyebrows, I'm like, blink my eyebrows. Blink, you know, my eyelashes. Sometimes they're just too tired, I'm like, oh. Can you feel, sometimes I can feel it when I'm blinking my eyelashes, they feel that heavy. You know, just everything just feels heavy, I'm so fatigued. And then when I get to bed, and I don't go to bed late, it's like... Sleep and awake and asleep and awake and asleep and awake and asleep and awake. I'm like, oh, forget it. Those are the breaks, hey? So, like I said, let me know how you're going on with Prednis alone or anything. You know, drop a comment. I'd love to hear what you think. You know, if you're suffering, then yeah, you know, share. I like to listen and I will you know, comment back, write back to you. But yeah, three tablets. Wow. I couldn't believe it. I was thinking to myself, has he got the right patient? Yeah, you know. But yeah, um, like I said, it's a journey, this tapering down of prednisolone, and it's a long journey. You know, it's if you go too quick with it, you can get into myasthenia crisis, which one doesn't want. And myasthenia crisis is like when you get severe laboured breathing and, um, you know, you would have to be admitted to hospital. So, yeah, that's it. You know, like I said, sleep can be an issue. Um, my eyes, um, you know, they're, they're okay. The um, droopiness isn't there because, like I said, with my previous videos, Back at the beginning, when I first started YouTube, you know, one eyebrow would be up here, one eyebrow would be down there. And that's just me face trying to compensate for the weakness. So, yeah, that was fun, trying to draw eyebrows. Um, but, yeah, my eyes are okay. Um, so I'm thankful for that, you know, both looking in the same direction. Because one would be looking there, one would be looking around the corner. But yeah, 
Um, I'm blessed. I'm thankful to God for each day, you know. Um, and like I said, it's a journey, you know. I'm trying to get on that healthy kick, trying to do that healthy thing, looking after myself. So, you know, I just wanted to tell you all my news. Yes, not one tablet, honeys, but three. Remember Dusty Bin? Do you remember that? It was like three, two, one. Could, oh, forget it. Anyway, yeah, I just wanted to tell you all my news. Um, yeah, so I will be checking in again. Uh, possibly, well, no, I will be checking in at the beginning of September. Um, you know, and let you know how I'm doing. If anything has reoccurred. Um, but for now, I'm doing okay. You know, and I hope, I truly hope, wherever you are in the world, you have a wonderful day. Um, there's a whole hell of a lot going on, you know, um, yeah, be kind to one another, be kind to yourselves, you know, you do you, and hey, let's keep smashing this life, and God bless, and I will see you soon for another video. Thanks for watching. Bye.